forgot to show him my titties. <laughs> I don't know how to get past them. Like right now, these guys aren't very strong, but later on, I'd say there's going to be some pretty crazy guys you're going to have to sneak around. Because I'm not, I don't have like, I only got a little blaster. <clears throat> Just shoot him like three times <laughs> to kill him. <clears throat> there's some guy who is going to try to take advantage of the fact that all the authorities are busy fighting the rebellion the rebels and they're gonna try to make a bunch of money and side story you're starting your own gang at this very same time so i'm guessing you're gonna have to fight other gangs uh And now it's on hard or challenging or whatever the hardest is. There's gotta be a way out. Oh, he dropped the health push. Oh, he got me. There's heals everywhere, I just, uh, couldn't get to them with a dying. When they die, they drop, uh, vials. I only have two vials at the moment, though. Oh, what the hell? I get to drive this? Ah, it. it has health and armor. Here we go. Come on. Is this open world concept? Um, sort of. There's areas, right? And the areas are like open world or semi open world. But it's not all one giant world. It's different areas that make up a world. You there? The comms are working? Yeah. Hey, these bandits are still after me. So I think you can just, you could probably fast travel to here. But like, this is, this is how big this area is, right? We don't know how big, uh, the, like the bigger world is there. It's normal for Kay's reputation to fluctuate when you switch partnerships. Performing jobs for a syndicate helps Kay get in their good books. Loyalties change, betrayals are inevitable, and a resourceful outlaw must know how to play the underworld to their advantage. Okay. So we have... The Pike Syndicate, the Crimson Dawn, and the Hot Cartel. Oh, that's pretty cool. Armored Undershirt. Fulfill personal requests. Okay. Oh, so your abilities are things that experts teach you. And you can have loadouts. 